Hey Zabibas, this is Super Zombie God Barbecue, and today we're going to talk about the shield because you've probably gone on YouTube and seen tens to hundreds of videos of people playing with the shield in WWE 2K17 or 2K18, and you're wondering to yourself when you get the game, which is released tomorrow, why don't I have access to the shield? Why can't I get the shield myself? Well, this is a tutorial of how to unlock the shield on WWE 2K18. And there's details of how to get their power bomb, how to use their entrance, including how to get their brand new attires, their brand new t-shirts, and more. Before we get into the details though, if you can smash that like button as hard as you can, we go for 500 likes in the video. But let's get right back into this, and the first thing you need to do is download off of Community Creations the Shield updated attires. Included are Seth Rollins, Roman Reigns, and Dean Ambrose. And you'll see the creators here, Karanka Lega, who's the person who's created this one on PlayStation Network. On Xbox, I don't have the details, but if someone in the comment section could let us know, I will pin it to the top of the comment section. But this Seth Rollins is particularly good because it not only includes his shield attire, but also his burn it down attire. Now this person has actually made Roman Reigns and Dean Ambrose on his creator wrestler and uploaded it to the community creations. So you first of all go to Shield Roman. This one was done by Sketch Panic. And Sketch Panic, and obviously you can type in the word Shield into the hashtag search, but you can also find he's got a version of Shield Seth, as well as Shield Dean, but it doesn't have the burn it down Seth. So there is the two Roman and Dean that you require for this to work. Now once you've downloaded both of these, and there's also a cheeky little Colonel Sanders and one of the uh, the old rumoured United States Championship changed it, changes which never ended up going through. Once you've downloaded these, you need to set these as alternate attires. And you could do that by going to edit the custom attires in the Create a Superstar options. And then you need to recreate the shield because to reunite the shield, you actually have to set the shield up. Again, call them the shield. Now, as long as you have set the separate attires as alternate attires for Dean Ambrose, Seth Rollins, and Roman Reigns, you'll then see that when you do choose them, you will have the option to choose the separate attire that you'll see coming up. You'll see here you can then go to Team Announce and pick the shield. There is a secret team for Golden Truth as well. But set the first member as Dean Ambrose, the second member as Roman Reigns, and the third member as Seth Rollins. Don't worry that the attires are not showing up at the moment because they will not show until much later on when you are in a game. Once you've done this, make sure you change the crowd reaction to cheer, or you're gonna get a Roman Reigns-esque reaction, which obviously is not realistic, unless you want them to be booed. Now, once you've done that, you can change your team, tag team moves, so if you are playing a two versus two, but otherwise the shield power bomb is already in the game, but is only accessible for the shield. Once you need to create an entrance you want to Effectively, you can forget about a tag team entrance, but this way, at least when you have a tag team match, they're not going to come out like absolute bozos or looking like Rhino and Heath Slater. Not that there's anything wrong with Rhino and Heath Slater, but they're not quite the shield, you know? So you want to be changing the motion to the shield. You want to be changing the music to Roman Reigns as the shield music at the moment does not exist on the game, but maybe that will change in the future. Tell you what, I would absolutely love for a showcase. Maybe 500 likes on this video will get a showcase made. Maybe do portions of a showcase mode. For 2K18 as maybe like a concept or something. But here we go, custom entrance and tag. You now want to be making sure that everyone is in the right places. So make sure Roman Reigns is coming from the left and Dean Ambrose or Seth Rollins are coming on the right. What you don't want to happen is have the wrong people coming at the wrong places, otherwise it's just gonna look very, very weird. Now, in terms of creating the Titan Tron and the music, of course you use Roman Reigns' music. With the ribbon, I used a very weird selection. A lot of people, when I said this, thought it was a little bit odd, but I decided to use Billy Kay because it just gave the best, I don't know, the best 
version as close as you can get to the shield. You then want to use the Usos as the movie on the wall. All this is completely unnecessary. You can choose whatever you want, but I chose the Colognes for the stage ramp movie. Getting to the apron and the ringside area, I chose the club for this one and I turned off the ringside LEDs. So I kept the LEDs at the bottom of the ring and then I kept this exactly the same for the trio. So you're pretty much done now. Make sure you got the cast right. Press accept and there is a shield as a tag team created and unlocked in game. The next thing you want to do is go to trio entrance settings. And at this point, you will then see that you have the exact same options come up and you effectively want to do everything exactly the same. So, for example, you want to set up the shield as the custom trio entrance. Nice little evolution gimmick there. And again, entrance music, movies, everything, just make it sure it's exactly the same as last time. And this time it will show again Dean Ambrose in the wrong place. So make sure that the cast is moved into these sections. So Roman Reigns as the first, Dean Ambrose as the second, and Seth Rollins as the third. And the, the best way to choose who appears first for Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins is Dean Ambrose should appear first and climb over to the left of Seth Rollins who climbs over to the right. Then just make sure that everything looks the best it can. Click finish entrance and then you are done. At this point now you can choose the shield and you can also create a victory as well. And you want to do this although in W2K18 at the moment this is slightly broken and the trio victories or losses are currently not working properly. But as soon as that is fixed you'll be able to see the sweet shield victory in all of its glory including the shield fist celebration. Otherwise you don't need to change anything about this. Just make sure that or unlike what I've done here, I've got it slightly wrong. You want to change where Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose are in order and make sure Roman Reigns is in the middle. And here you're going to see a preview of what it should look like to have the shield back together on WWE 2K18. Again, you want Dean Ambrose to be on the right hand side slightly unstable the, the very very erratic moves you want roman reigns in the middle and then you have seth rollins on the right hand side once you've done that press accept and save and now you'll see now when you go into play as the shield they will all link together and you'll have the alternate attires and here is what the entrance looks like Now another common question that I've got is how to do the shield powerbomb. So but the shield powerbomb is very simple. You won't be able to do this unless you are Roman Reigns. And then you'll see here I've magnified hold R1 or on Xbox hold RB and triangle stroke Y. Whatever console you've got and that will then initiate an OMG segment which includes the superstar being picked up by Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins and Roman Reigns and crashes him to the floor. Poor Xavier Woods. Who has it happened to him unfortunately again? And again. And again, just for good luck.
And there we have it. That is how to unlock the shield and to get that updated attires in WWE 2K18. Let me know what you thought about this tutorial in the comment section below. And if you want any other tutorials regarding updated attires, updated entrances, that seems to be something that's very popular this year in WWE 2K18. Enjoy launch day and I will see you all online. Make sure to follow me on Twitch and to subscribe to me on YouTube. Like this video and see you soon.